my damn kids. I got a 13-year-old. I got a 13-year-old that cuss like a sailor. I don't know where the hell he got that shit from. Seriously, I told my son, I said, son, daddy gonna be a comedian. My son looked at me and said, daddy, you gonna be a commodian? I said, a commodian? He said, yeah, because you full of shit. So you ain't working with my kids mad as hell, seriously. I don't understand it. I had my kids the old-fashioned way, by accident. You know, it's cool, it's cool, but it's all good, it's all good. You know, kids are bad as shit, man. I don't understand some shit. My son told me he was gonna run away from home. I told myself, why run when I can drive your ass? I'm serious. I don't understand my kids. And we're gonna go with me on this one. You know, when my kids were little, you know, I told my son, my son wouldn't eat, you know, you know how expensive food is? My son wouldn't eat. I told my son, there's kids in Africa starving. My son went and called his cousin in Nigeria and said, I got something for you. <laughs> Fucked up, man, I hate my kids. I don't understand them. But it's all good, it's all good. But you know, we doing some shit, we getting stuff better now. You know, but like I said, I just moved to my new neighborhood. I just moved to my new white neighborhood. And you know, shit is a whole lot different in my new neighborhood than it was in my old neighborhood. You know, in my old neighborhood, you know, some of them were breaking my house. Wouldn't nobody say shit. <laughs> Now in my new neighborhood, hell, I got a car from nine white people that work telling me there was a black man breaking in my house. Man, I ain't never seen nine white people so happy in my life. They asked me, should they call the police? I said, hell yeah, you call the police. Shit. They ain't white people a chance to do the two things they like doing most in the whole wide world. Telling on black people and calling the police. You know what's rough, man, it's all good, man, you know? Because I say, you know, shit is crazy, man. The world is changing. You know, there's a lot of stuff I don't understand. You know, like I'm getting older now. And getting older, I'm trying to date again. You know, and um, I found out some shit. Online dating is causing problems in my marriage. <laughs> shit is crazy. You know, seriously. One woman called me, on my, my wife called me on my cell phone. I look down, and by habit, I swipe left. <laughs> it's crazy, man, but it's all good. You know, it's cool, you know, you know. But like I said, I'm getting older now. And I remember when I was younger, I used to date cougars. But now that I'm getting older, I date mountain lions. Seriously. That shit was funny. <laughs> but it's cool, you know. But like I said, dating is changing, man. You know, and this, this online dating shit is crazy. You know, women put all kinds of crazy shit in their profile. Women put their profile. I fuck like a rabbit. I asked her what her name was. She said, Bunny. What kind of shit is that? Seriously. Another lady told me that profile, you know, I got one leg. And then she asked me how big my dick was. I said, One foot. Shit, but it's cool. You know? I said, Okay, we're gonna keep this shit moving along. But you know, like I said, relationships are crazy, man. I'm trying to do better, man. I'm trying to do better. You know, like I said, you know, I'm trying to be a better parent. I'm not gonna make the same mistakes my father made. When I leave my family, I ain't never coming back. <laughs> you know, it's real, man, it's real. You know, kids are crazy, man, you know. You know, cause my son, man, and it's, my son is getting to the age of having a serious conversation. So, I bought my son a box of condoms. And I told my son, if my father had done this for me, we wouldn't be having this conversation. <laughs> this shit is real. But you know, but like I say, you know, it's all good, man. Kids are great, man. But you know, but anyway, that's my time. Thank you.